Get in the shot. Leave it. Hey, Zach with Money Pit RC. I'm a length bending machine. Actually, I'm not gonna paint. You're doing it too. <laughs> Your back window just fell. <laughs> Fluffernutter in them. Do it just. What's up, boys? What's up, boys? Roast and rigs. This may be the best looking truck we've ever gotten. This is currently my favorite SCX24. I've had this one for a couple weeks now. I've been trying to drag this out, hoping that the owner forgot about it and I could just keep it. He didn't forget yet. This truck was sent to us. Simply underscore 24s. This guy's this guy's fairly new to SCX 24s. He messaged me a while ago and sent me pictures of his little drift cars, and I just knew this guy was going to be something serious. First of all, he sent me this. This is his inspiration for the build, and this is awesome. Thank you so much. Now. Let's just take a moment of silence and look at this thing. For anyone unaware, this is a Playmobil toy body. It started as this. This is the same thing. He cut the back off, shortened it, this side had doors, this is what it started like. This is so good. He's actually working on another one right now, but I'll just keep that a secret, just in case I get to show it off. This is so good. This hubcap came with the toy. It was part of the toy. He glued a little magnet. to the back of it and that magnet grabs onto the lug nut thing. That's awesome. It's so good. He has the full interior still. I can't even tell where there was door lines at before. And like enclosing the cab and cutting the roof. This is so good. The roof on the original one removable. The roof on his, still removable. Dude, I can ride with you. I love this. He sent me another little treat inside the luggage here on top. So one of the first things I asked him about, he had made an antenna on one of his WT micro bodies. I told him how awesome it was and I sent him a picture of my Miata antenna. As you can see, I bent it into a heart. Look at what he sent me. Sweet dude. 
Thank you for that. I just realized he even shortened the roof rack. The roof rack originally looks like this on the toy. This is so good. He left the engine but he didn't paint it or detail it. It just says green over spray. This would have been such a good opportunity to get rid of the trunk lid and detail the engine. <laughs> as far as the actual build, nothing special. Bunch of random purple stuff. He's got trail links, trail shocks on an Injora carbon chassis, C10 wheelbase couple different little random trio bits, Emax servo, brass, brass front knuckles, running Proline Hyrax tires, purple Enjora motor with the stock ESC slash radio, and then it's attached with magnets. It's interesting that he chose purple. I'm feeling maybe a bus showdown episode after this one. This is mine, by the way. It's been a, it's been a bit of an ongoing joke with this guy about my Carnage beadlock rings and how I like to hoard them. So I hit up Carnage and asked him if he could make me a little license plate for this guy. I like that. Thank you, Carnage, for the license plate. Carnage RC. He's on Etsy and Instagram. Obviously, this isn't going to be one of our top performers. It's not what this is about. This is about looking sick. Also, it's important to note, he's already a bit over this. He doesn't think this is good. He knows he can do better. We're going to see some cool stuff. Guys, check it out. I just found another frog. This is actually very smooth for stock, stock remote, stock ESC. It's not perfect, but it's not super jumpy like some of them that we've seen.
solace. Oh, that was actually pretty good. That freaking thing just stung me. Guys, I hate to say this, but I think this is better than... We're getting serious now. We've detached both bedsides, unintentionally. Dude. I think this is better than some of the actual, like, performing trucks we've been sent. We just lost a side mirror. It's down in here somewhere. I see it. Got it. Dang, man, I'm sorry I'm just ruining your truck. We'll see what else we can knock off of it. Dude, this is actually pretty steep. No way it gets up this the whole way. No, okay. Final thoughts. I need to start by saying I'm sorry about your side mirror and I'm sorry about your wood bedsides. I was going to glue these back on, but since I'm shipping this back, I think I'm going to ship them back off of it. That way they don't get knocked back off since there's not much to hold them on. Your side mirror can be reattached if you'd like to. I'm going to toss it in your little luggage thing. Real quick, video after the video. I just remembered I have a full set of mirrors from my bus 
So I'll just toss this in your little luggage thing. Once again, sorry about that. I was getting a bit overconfident. Boys, what do we think about this? What do we think about this one? You guys like it? I'm impressed with this stock setup. This wasn't the smoothest, but it wasn't bad. I hate the purple. I don't think I really have too much to say about this one. This is way better than I could do. This is actually the reason I bought my second bug bus. Bus. This is actually the reason that I bought my second bus body was to cut it and do this. But there's no way I'm doing it better. Doing. I bought my second bus body to do this to it. But there's no way I'm doing it better than this. And I'm not even going to bother. <clears throat> yeah, this is awesome. Let me get a thumbnail real quick. Daggone it, I busted the things off and I needed a th thumbnail. I wonder if I can lean it. <laughs> That's not going to work. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed.